A federal judge in Miami has struck down parts of a Florida immigration law banning sanctuary city policies. It's something Governor DeSantis has been pushing since the beginning of his run for office, leading up to the moment that he signed the bill in 2019. But now this federal judge, her name is Beth Bloom, says portions of the law are unconstitutional and racially motivated. DeSantis's office says it will appeal the ruling. Florida's Attorney General Ashley Moody joins us now. Good morning, Ashley. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Thanks for coming on. What was your reaction when this ruling went down? You know, I've served as a lawyer, a prosecutor, a judge for over a decade. This is one of the most nonsensical rulings uh, I've seen in my decades in law. I, I can tell you, as the attorney general uh, and working alongside Governor DeSantis, we have fought to ensure that Florida is a rule of law state, that we uh, do everything within our power to protect our citizens and ensure law enforcement hands aren't tied uh, in removing folks that are here uh, illegally, that are criminals, that uh, need to be deported for the safety of our communities. And to see a judge come in and, and again, tie our hands, mm -hmm. uh, it, it, it's, it's um, I think it's disgusting and I think it undermines uh, the security and safety and stability of this state and our country as a whole. So Ashley, we have a lot of viewers down in Florida. What does this mean for them? How is this gonna affect their communities? You know, I, I think they want leadership that will step up and do what our federal government certainly isn't doing. Uh, my lawyers are in court this morning on another case where we had to sue the Biden administration because they went against decades policy of refusing to deport uh, those that are here illegally that are criminals. Uh, drug traffickers, burglars, just not doing it anymore, and we had to sue. So we're arguing mm -hmm. fiercely in court this morning. So think about it. You have a federal government that says, states, you can't do anything about it. That's our purview, but we're not going to do anything either. Right. So they're tying the hands of leadership within states to make the best decisions they can and pass policies and laws to protect their citizens. And then you have a judge upend it with a ruling. So we're having to fight from both sides. But I can tell you, Governor DeSantis and I will continue to do so in court with every ounce of energy and passion that we have. What do you know about this judge? Her name is uh, Beth Bloom. I can tell you that uh, we repeatedly see judges across the country uh, that may not personally agree with laws uh, and, will, and will make findings and rulings, uh, which I believe are, are baseless and not grounded in, in law, yeah. uh, to uh, follow along what they personally believe the law should be. Yeah, she says racially look, motivated, but really, I mean, these, if you're here illegally, isn't that breaking the law? Again, it's nonsense. Judges' jobs, I can tell you, I was a judge for over a decade before having the opportunity to be Florida's attorney general. A judge's job is to take the law that's given to them and apply it to facts. And here you have a judge that has uh, rendered a ruling that will effectively tie our hands in Florida from ensuring that our law enforcement can help federal officials, if they will, uh, enforce the rule of law and our immigration laws. Ashley Moody, the Florida Attorney General. Ashley, thanks for joining us. I'm so grateful. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. Hi, everyone. I'm Brian Kilmeade. I want you to do me a favor. I want you to click to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page. This is the only way that I know for sure that you're not going to miss any great commentary, any great news bites, any great interviews coming your way on Fox. You can get it all here on YouTube. So subscribe right now.